guys, you're behind the scenes of my cold water deer. I just finished doing shoot one. Oh, but this is the deer. Uh, there's no longer any ice in this, and my hair is soaked. Um. I'm just trying to get like all this wet so I can do like this or something. <laughs> That's freezing, guys. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, but behind the scenes and my forehead is cold. And this water is freezing. <laughs> water in my mouth. Water in my mouth. I mean, um, hair in my mouth. Oh, uh, yeah. I got these awesome new knee high socks. <laughs> and I just love them so much. I have like some little different signs that I keep finding. Yeah. Okay, candy cane. Can can into water. I wonder what will happen if I actually like drop in this little Don't ask me why I have a knife. Well, you'll see why. Mm. Okay, well, I just got water in this bag. And sucked it out. Mm. Oh, crap. Oh, the ultimate dare. Drain the water. <sighs> Delicious. <sighs> God. Guys, never do this. Horrible deer, I'm probably gonna get pneumonia after this. My Aunt Peggy actually died of pneumonia, so I'm pretty sure about that. Mm, oh well. See how low it is? Can I keep going? Can't do it. Ah. Uh. Oh, wow, I'm gonna be rude. Uh, no, I'm not being forced to do any of this. Except for a couple things I'm being forced to do, like the chubby bunny challenge. I did do the chubby bunny challenge. Mm. I'm forced to do the chubby bunny challenge. There's another deer act I'm forced to do. Oh, guys, you guys might get a sneak peek of me and my girl meeting for the first time. Of me and Wolf Girl meeting for the first time in a really long time. And uh I miss her, I really do. And uh our phone calls, I love talking to her and I love being able to tell her anything. She's my sister. She 
she's pretty much my sister. Um, I know you're playing with Katie. Uh, no, but she's like my sister. She's the sister I've never had. My real sister isn't my real sister. I don't have a real 100% full authentic sister. I am pretty much the, an only child. I have a half sister. That means that we have the same mother, but not the same father. She has a stepfather. I'm practically an only child. My sister, she tries her best to keep me out of her life. That's why I have Sarah. She's the sister I've never had. She's my other half, pretty much. I hate riding with her. I love joking around with her, though. It's just fun. And then we have our serious chats, and we get all down to earth, and then we can joke, and it's like, <laughs> it's just fun. I love her. She's my other half. We're both. Don't know if she wants to say that. <laughs> uh, but, yeah. When she doesn't care that I'm bisexual. That means I like boys and girls. She doesn't care that I'm that. No matter what, we're there for each other. We're far apart right now, actually. And we're gonna go see Catching Fire together. Cause my, cause I begged my dad. Wolf Girl's my other half. Do you have a problem with her? Do you have a problem with me? Do you have a problem with me? Do you have a problem with her? Okay, that's what you guys need to get straight. I've actually seen some really nice comments saying like, Oh, you have a hot friend. That's just like so nice to hear. I mean, it's kind of weird and creepy and stalkerish. But it's really sweet. And knowing that you guys like her as much as I do just shows how much connected. I love Sarah. She's my other half. Without her, I probably wouldn't be here right now. I probably, I probably would have already hanged myself. Yeah. I'm serious, guys. She's my other half. She has saved me before. She didn't even know I was going through depression, and yet she still kind of saved me. She knows if I'm lying. If I say I'm fine, and she know, and she usually knows if I'm lying. Say if I, if I say I'm fine, and she knows I'm really not, she'll make me tell the truth. I mean, I love her. I love her like a sister. She's. I swear, I keep saying that. I'm sorry, but if she doesn't like something that I like, I get over it. So we're like, super G. I was kind of. She was like, okay, that's fine. And then I was like, kind of like, mm. And then I started getting more into it. And then when we kind of parted, I still listen to Super Junior sometimes. It's a K-pop group. It's so beautiful. She's the one who got me into anime. That's not the only reason I like her. We're just really good friends. And I don't know what I'd do without her. This was supposed to be behind the scenes. This turned into Why I Love Sarah. He keeps me sane. <laughs> yes, guys, I'm sane. And I don't cut. I probably would cut. That's why I. What did I do with that knife? Oh, what did I do with the knife? That's bad. <laughs> Found it. See all these little. There are a lot of chips. There has to be some chips. I don't remember saying chips. Right? It's a couple chips. That's for my skin cutting the actual blade. I used to cut this by wear these. I'm not going to show you. But I stopped because I'm at her. Oh, we became really close friends. 
I remember our first sexual conversation. It was on a school bus on our way home from a field trip. <laughs> yeah, and Sarah, if you're watching this, thanks for being there for me. Well, this is Pepe Sensei saying, if you don't like Wolf Girl, you don't like me. Bye.